Hello everyone, another day, another lead code question. So today we have 1299, replace elements with greatest element on the right. It's a really good problem to have if you have an upcoming interview. So it has 1000 likes and 150 dislikes. So let's read the problem first. Given an array ARR, replace every element in that array with the greatest element among the elements to its right and replace the last element with minus one. After doing so, return an array. Let's look for, for the example. So we're given an array over here. So we get an array 17, 18, 5, 4, 6, 1. And then let's fill it in the output array. So for the index zero, we're going to ask what's the greatest among the highlighted uh, elements? It's 18. Then for the next uh, first element, what's the greatest on the right? It's six. Then for the next element, what's the greatest over here? Six. Then for the next element, what's the greatest between six and one? It's six. And then for the next one, what's the greatest between one, one? And the last element will do minus one. So this is the output array, 18, six, 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 one, minus one. So this is the question. So how we can solve it? So the way to solve it is actually starting looping from the back of the array and then check what's the maximum we've seen so far. So let's do that. First, we put minus one, like just the way they want it. And then we say, what's the greatest between minus one and one? It's one. So we put one here. And then next, what are we going to say? What's the greatest between minus one, one and six? It's six. So we put six over here. The next, what they're going to ask, what's the greatest between four, six and one? It's six and so on. So we'll fill in the array in the same way, but starting from the backwards. So let's see how it implements in code. So here's the 18. So let's see how it can implement in code. So first we say let write, write max equal minus one. And that's basically our maximum element from the right. We'll later replace it by the maximum of the current element that we on and the previous maximum. Okay, and then we create the for loop looping from the back, we say for let i equal array dot length minus one. So basically looping from the back, i is greater than equal to zero, and then i minus minus. So just the basic, uh, you know, loop from the back. And then what are we going to say, we're going to say, let's find the new maximum. So the new maximum, we have math dot floor. And then what are we going to look for? So uh, ma mass that max, sorry, mass that max. And then what are we going to look for? Let's say we on the element four, we're going to look and say, what's the maximum current maximum is four or the maximum that we see before. So what's the maximum between current element at I array from I or the right max. And then here we like say it's six. And then what are we going to do? So then we say array at what I equal to right max. So that's the maximum that we've seen so far, right max. So in the first iteration, we say minus one, then we say what's the greatest minus one or one, we put one and then the next iteration, we say what is the greatest six or one, we put six. So over here, we're going to have to replace right max with new max. So the new max that we calculated over here, so we calculate it over here, the new max, and then we set it to the current element that we're looking for. And then at the end, we'll return the array. So let's see, uh, let's submit and see how we did. All right, so we got 47% on speed and 78% on memory usage. So that's how you solve 1299 replace element with greatest sum in JavaScript. Thank you.